In today's video, I'll show you how to create an Instagram carousel post using Canva. So, let's begin. We'll create a four-page carousel post, each sized 1080 by 1080 pixels. So, the total width will be 4,320 pixels. Open Canva. Click on Custom Size. Take a 4,320 by 1,080 pixels canvas. Go to Files, then Settings. Click on Add Guides. Choose Custom. Change columns to four and gap to zero pixels. Click on Add Guides. In this way, you can get four separate parts on your canvas. Go to Elements. Add a square shape. Place it on the left. Change its color to black. Now, we'll add our model images. Remove their backgrounds. Adjust their size and position. After this, duplicate this shape. Change its color to light red to match with our first model. Expand it halfway into the second part. Send it to the back. Duplicate and place it behind the second model. Change its color to light gray to match with the model. Now, duplicate this shape again and place it here. Go to text, add a heading, type your text, scale its font size, make it uppercase, change its color to white, remove bold, rotate it 90 degrees and place it on this shape. Duplicate this text, reduce its font size, type your text. Rotate it 90 degrees and place it below the first text. Add a heading. Type collection. Go to Google. Search for dot copy paste. Open the first website. Click to copy the dot you like. Paste the dot here. Complete the text like us. Change its font size to 60 pixels. Remove bold. Click on effect, then curve. Adjust its angle to make it circular. Adjust its size and position. Go to Elements and search for Polka Dots. In the Graphics section, add this element. Change its color to black. Adjust its size and position. Click on the three dots, then Layer. Send backward. Add a heading, type the date. Go to Font. Search for Grotesque Grand. Choose Grotesque Grand Extra Bold Font. Change font size to 50 pixels. Place it on top. Make it uppercase. Next, add a subheading. We'll open Google Keep to copy our pre-made text for this post. Paste it here. Go to Font and choose Grotesque Light Font. Change font size to 20 pixels. Change alignment to justify. Adjust its position. Add 
After this, go to Elements and search for Glitch Halftone. In the Graphics section, add this one. Adjust its size and position. Reduce its transparency to 20%. Go to Position, then Layers. Now place it below these two models. Next, search for halftone dots. In graphics, take this one. Add a heading. Type 50%. Go to font and search for Extenda 40. Select the font. Change font size to 260 pixels. Change its color to white. Next, type off. Go to font. Choose grotesque bold font. Change font size to 100 pixels. Set letter spacing to 100. Adjust text positions. Now duplicate this shape and place it on the last part of the canvas. Go to color. Choose gradient. Change the first color to gray. And the second one to red. Now add a line. Change its color to white. Stroke weight to 5 pixels. Change both end styles. Choose line type as elbowed. Create this line shape. Duplicate it and create another one like us. Now, adjust their positions. Copy the next paragraph. Duplicate this text. Paste the paragraph here. Adjust its position in this borderline. Add texts below this discount. Duplicate this line and create a small straight line. Place it under this paragraph. Similarly, add texts in this border box. Duplicate this font. Type follow text. Set line spacing to zero. Make alignment left. Change its font size to 80 pixels. Make it uppercase. Next, add your brand logo. Go to Elements and search for Thread Circle. In Graphics, add this one.
Go to position. Bring logo to front. We'll change this element and text color to match our logo. Now add social icons. Select an icon. Go to position then arrange. Change size to 150 pixels. Similarly, reduce all icon sizes. Adjust their positions. Duplicate this text. Add brand's username. Choose grotesque regular font. Change font size to 40 pixels. Change its color to black. Make alignment center. Our design is ready. Now, download it in PNG format. Then go to Google and search for Instagram Carousel Maker. Open the first website. Upload your image. Choose Carousel. Change columns to four. Click on Split and Preview. Our four separate images are ready. Click here to download all images. In this way, you can create an Instagram Carousel post and use it on social media. Thank you for joining me in this video. If you found it helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. If you have any questions, feel free to leave your comments, and I'll see you in the next video.